Let's go on a tour of the resort. Candy store where we spent about $30. This is the hallway where we spent about an hour waiting to get into our room. Oh, the front desk. So many memories. So many good, good memories. This is the huge long hallway to get to the pool at Arcade. This is where Miles and Shannon and Sawyer did some pottery. This is the arcade where we spent 90% of our time. Make that 99% of our time. You want to go super fast, hit that green button when it comes on. In case you thought Miles was a fluke yesterday. <laughs> no. That's Killing it. Playing just to make me mad because I said don't play the game where you win the big ball because we don't have room to take it home. <laughs> Sawyer's found his new favorite game. What's been your favorite part so far? Uh, the arcade. In the hot tub. You go outside in the hot tub? No. This is the pool area where we've spent about 1% of our time considering this is why you pay so much money is to play at the pool area. Put your hand in my hand Come on, little honey, let me tell you what I'm feeling I was on the floor on the bottom All I want to do is sit in the hot tub Which is probably super gross Now we can forget it, cause it's time to believe it To believe it Yeah, I can be a soul when you're telling me to soul you want this place looks and as cool as it's looking with my slow motion our experience here has been horrible we got locked out of our room yesterday for an hour the door lock doesn't work it's gotten 
two new keys. Now waiting on somebody to let us into our room. That pretty much sums it up right there. After we were somewhere, so we had no access to our key cards to go play video games or swimsuits or anything, and they just left us in the hallway for an hour. No sense of urgency whatsoever. It took us two and a half hours to get into our room when check-in starts at four. We didn't get into our room till 6.30. We had to wait around for two and a half hours. When we got to the room, there was no sheets on the beds. And then one of the beds had sheets and it was like crusty and nasty, like they had just made it over without actually cleaning them and changing them. We didn't get the crib that we requested when we checked, when we reserved the room a few weeks or a week ago. It took us, we didn't get the crib until 11 o'clock at night. So it's just been really bad. I've, I've talked to the managers and complained a little bit, but I've noticed that everybody's complaining. I've spent most of my time at the front desk. We looked online and there's actually more people complaining about the place than anything else. And on their Facebook page, which tells you a lot, they don't allow any comments or posts. So they can only, you can only comment on their posts. They, they don't want you giving any reviews or anything like that, which tells a lot about a place. And I don't know if I mentioned, we were here a few years ago and it was fantastic. And like I said, I, we read and heard from a few people that it used to be really, really good and then it just went downhill over the past few years. Sad. Well, now they changed their mind. They want to do everything at the water park. So they're gonna try this flow rider surfing thing. Boogie board. Let's see how this works out. <laughs> Good job, man. Was that fun? See if Bubba can do it now. <laughs> Try again. Get up on the ceiling, fly through our air. Believe it, baby, so high we can't forget it. There's no time for feeling. We have to believe. So believe it, baby, so high we can see angels there up on the ceiling. Fly through our head. Go believe it, baby, say me, 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 I don't think I ever showed you guys the room. It's not bad. Kitchen area, which is good with the kids. There's a Murphy's bed in there. If you don't know what that is, it flips down, there's a bed. Sofa bed. Fireplace. TV. So not bad. Like I said, just not a good experience. Bathroom. Right, and I'm not alone. I will conquer.